so today I'm going to share with you um, a lipstick and lip gloss haul. I have all my lipsticks and all my lip glosses out and I'm going to share with you the um, ones that I just love. I'm just going, I have so much that um, I had to pick and choose. It is going to be kind of long because I'm going to talk briefly about each one because I have like over 30 products probably lined up so um, if you guys want to like skip through it, I totally understand. Um, but I'm going to um, start. So the first ones are um, Victor Victoria's Secret. Um, Bath and Body Works. These. Um, I love the Vanilla Whipped the most. The Vanilla Whip is tastes like vanilla, honestly. Um, I'm not crazy about cotton candy, but it is nice. And then this is grapefruit. As you can tell, it's pretty old and I've used quite a lot of it. But um, Victoria Bath and Body Works has great, great um, lip gloss. Great lip gloss. And if you get color ones, they are the color that they show in the tube. Um, Sephora, I only have... Um, actually, I have four from Bath and Body Works. This is pineapple. Um, these are from Sephora, and this one is Perfect Nude, and I've used a good bit of that. I really, really like this stuff. The only thing I don't like is it, um, uh, is a little, um, sticky, but overall it's good quality. Um, and then I have Nectar Shine from Sephora. Oh, it's called Peach Shine, but, um... I think it's like the it, the gloss is called Nectar Shine, but it's Peach Shine. So I really like these. These are really good quality, and um, they stay on your lips for a good bit. The next is Avon. These lip glosses are pretty um, pigmented in itself. Um, this one ha is like kind of like um, menthol-y on your lips, and this is the Plump Pout. It one from Avon, they're pretty old. And this is Glazeware. Yeah, these are both the same color. Um, I just stock up since my grandmother works there at Avon. So, um, these definitely are really nice. I'll show you the tube. Yeah, they're like really nice. And they smell decent too. They're pretty like sweet smelling. Um, I have two lip glosses, a lip glass and um, a lip jelly from MAC. I'm not crazy like about these, but they are pretty nice and I have used a good bit from MAC um, for the pink lemonade and um, this is the fashion flower. These are very, very pigmented and they stay on your lips for a, a good long time so um, I definitely recommend them unless you don't want pigmentation. I mean, that's like really pigmented. So yeah. Um, I have all my lipsticks in a baggie because it is summer and at my house we don't have AC so I have to keep them in the refrigerator um, so that they don't melt. So the first ones are going to be drugstore. Come here. Alright. So I have five drugstore ones. Um, the first one is Burnt Coral. This is a red. This is a dark, dark red. Great for winter. And this is Rural Red. Yeah. Um, let's see. This is from... Where is this from? Rima London. And this is in Pink Champagne. One of my favorites. Like, it's legit pretty. I love it. Um, and this was in... This is from Revlon in Candy Pink. I, let's first examine the packaging. The packaging is so cute. It's ridiculous. Like... That is, look, that is just so freaking cute. 
and it doesn't like show up on your lips like that much. It's not. Like, I think it's pretty. It's decent. It's not that pigmented though. And then this is from um, Maybelline. And this is a nude. This one smells really good though. So it's in like that packaging. And I like it because like when you look like in the drugstore, you can see the color of it. So that's always good. Um, Sephora, I only have one. And I will never buy this again. It's nice and I'll use the rest of it. But I am not crazy about it because I can find um, a better one from MAC. So it looks like that. And it's in Attitude. Lip Attitude Star S24. Yeah. And it doesn't really look like the same thing, even though it says it does. I don't think it does at all. Whatever. Um, and I have one lipstick from Victoria's Secret, and um, it's in grapefruit. It smells legit like grapefruit. <laughs> that come on. This was seriously only 97 cents um, when it was like 75% off. It was amazing. And then the rest are my MAC lip glosses. Lip, lip glosses, lipsticks. Okay. Um, let's see. This is Lazy Day. Okay, let's establish something. This is why you leave your lipsticks in the refrigerator when you do not have AC. Because your lipsticks end up looking like that. Crap. So, yeah. I, I use, like, what I can of it and blend it in so it's not chunky. Um, so that's Lazy Day. Um, this is from the Viva La Glam, um, and it's Viva La Glam 2, so it looks like that. Um, okay, one of these, okay, these two are the same because I'm in love with these and I can't find a drugstore one this color, so it looks like this, but I'm going to show you the brand new one. And it's in Hue A20, so it looks like that. So, you can tell, this girl loves this lipstick. Like, legit. I love it. Mm, I think they changed the color, though. Like, I really do. I'm pretty sure they did. But, whatever. I just love the smell of MAC lip glosses. I mean, lipsticks. And then the last one is a luster one, and it's in Pretty Please, A41. And it looks like that. So, that's all my lipsticks and lip glosses, and I hope that you really, really love them. And um, if you want to know anything about any of the ones that I showed you, hit me up, comment below, like, and subscribe if you like my videos, and I will see y'all later. Bye!